Black Friday shoppers dealt with long lines at places like Orlando International Premium Outlets today. Thousands of people made their way this morning to find the best deals. Tony Atkins was out at an outlet mall speaking with shoppers. Thanksgiving is over, and now for many, it's time to shop. On Friday, the Orlando Premium Outlets was a solid go-to for shoppers. It's not as big of a scale in Australia Black Friday, so I'm just really looking forward to you know, being able to witness the madness of you know, Black Friday in America. It's good. It's moving really fast. This is crazy, though. It was almost to the street. It also was an opportunity for shoe resellers like Gerard Martinez, who we saw with dozens of Timberland boots he plans to sell. Not everybody lives in Florida, so they can't really get like the crazy outlet prices that they offer here, you know? Along with the long lines, we saw the parking lots fill up pretty quick. Lots near capacity for much of the morning. We wanted to wake up early so we could get good parking, and we did. We parked right in front of Nike. It was amazing. The National Retail Federation says about 8 million more people are expected to be out looking for deals this year than compared to Black Friday in 2021. This year, they expect 166 million people are planning to shop between Thanksgiving Day and Cyber Monday. And with so many shoppers, the mall says it's going to extend its hours today, normally closing at 9 o'clock. Today, they'll close at 10. So what has it been like today? Really good. Very exciting. Lots of excited shoppers. Lots of bags, lots of shopping, lots of deals. Marketing Director Lorena Garcia says with the traffic, take your time. But definitely give yourself a little bit of extra time to find a spot when you come out today. A little extra time for some big savings. Reporting in Orlando, Tony Atkins, West 2 News.